Hey guys, John Marie 13 or again, and uh, back with Jay, and guess what's gonna happen? Another beer review. Oh, all right. This time we have right. a great beer from Gee from uh, Beer Guy Reviews on YouTube TV. That's what we're looking at. No, it's not gonna focus, but fuck it. This is Bose Oh Natural Lug Lug Trade <clears throat> Logger Loggerdale. This one is made with love at our family. Run Brewery. And I'm really stoked to try this one. I think Jay's gonna love this one too, because it's supposed to be an amazing friggin' beer. This is uh, certified organic, so yeah. Gee's got some pretty good taste. Seriously. <clears throat> Gee's got an amazing beer. We got this for him. Metal! The ingredients will be local spring water, organic barley, and wheat. Wheat, malts, organic hops, and brewer's yeast. So yeah. Stoked to try this one. I think G's gonna love this one as well. Hope I do do. Unfortunately, we don't have a. Both of us had already had a couple beers, so we didn't think to bring down a fucking. Uh, you know, Super opener. Shabadoo. You know what? The last few beers that you opened with a lighter, you've had pretty good placement within a one foot radius. I learned that with the cap landing in the same spot is what I'm saying. I learned that from Fabian. You want me to pour that? Nope. I'm gonna pour this one. All right. Fine then. Fuck. Well done, sir. Yeah, you can pour this one. I will. But this one, Blood tread. this one pour, pour it with a little bit of head, because this one, I guess, is uh, deserving of it. <clears throat> a little bit of head there. Yeah, that is super clear. And this is obviously all natural. Really stoked to try this. Don't try it. Sniff it's away. Smelling it. Jesus. Bose Old Natural. Lug Tread. 600 mil. Yeah. Smells pretty good. Smells super clean. Yeah, very clean actually. And it's super, super clear. Amazingly clear. I don't know. Don't see a lot of bubbles going on there. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Just want to give it a taste, sir. Let's give it a taste, sir. Cheers, brother. Hmm. That is incredibly smooth. That is, that is one of the smoothest beers I've ever tasted in my that life. That is very fucking smooth. <clears throat> In all honesty, for sure, that is one of the smoothest beers I've ever tasted. I don't even know how to class that. I mean, the taste on it is just, uh, just real nice. Off, <clears throat> off the tongue, just real clear. Super, yeah, super refreshing, super clear. Incredibly, incredibly excellent aftertaste. I mean, it's very easy going down. It's uh, very late in the tongue, and there's uh, I mean, geez. it's not quite a dry taste, but. 
<clears throat> wow, that's a for a natural beer. That's fucking tasty. That just smells like a beer. Without question. Without any frilly, froofy, fruity smell or anything like that. That smells like a goddamn beer. And that's easy going down. It is easy going down. Um... That's really fucking good. That is incredibly good. This is not a mouth filler. You know, when you when when, when you take a sip of it, it's a sip. There, there's uh, the the carbonation is not too powerful. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. It's a, it's an all natural beer, man. That's pretty good. That's damn good. That is damn good beer right there. Shit. Easy going down. Light tasting. Five point two percent alcohol. Five point two. You like kind of ring this bottle out? Seriously, I've had light beers that were more offensive than this, as far as flavor goes. Oh, tons, tons and like tons of light beers are way more offensive than this. This is not even light beer. It's five point two percent. Five point. That is an incredibly delicious, delicious beer. Then again, here we are. I just keep looking at it because I can't believe how amazing it is. It's so clear. In fact, that's more clear than our domestic beers that we get it from our local brewery, which is just down the road. And everything tastes good about it. The smell, the taste. Well, that's fucking wicked, man. The aftertaste. Everything about it is amazing. <clears throat> I honestly... Don, in my heart of hearts, I'm going to give this a full-on five. We probably can't get that beer here, but right. if I could get that beer here, I would drink this beer religiously. Yeah, if we get that here, I would drink this all the time. This is great. And it is like a, uh, uh, what's that, like a 600 milliliter bottle. This is pretty damn fucking good. I mean, it's nice, it's tasty. That coffee brewed beer that we had, the Yeti stuff, the winter lager, was amazing. This is over the top delicious beer. This right here, with a rack of ribs that have been slow cooked for about eight hours repeatedly basted and then for the last little bit you candy coat it with a homemade yeah. uh, smoky barbecue sauce <clears throat> I'm gonna say uh, this would go perfect with any barbecue any meat dish whether it be beef pork chicken or seafood <clears throat> This is probably the most well-rounded beer that I've ever tried. In very, my life. very good, Gee. And, and, and for repose, guys, you guys gotta send that out here in the East Coast. You gotta. <laughs> this is fucking amazing. Anyways, guys, jump, motherfuckers. Dude.